home alone, you can run it, but let me home drivers, restaurants, all that. I would actually put a restaurant. Well, doesn't matter. It's fine. The class uh, ID, you know, uh, spec number 17, tax goes above. Okay. It's because it's your portfolio. You want to make sure it, because this looks professional. You know what I'm saying? So people can actually order. So you want to put the disclaimer. Okay. Um, make it closer, register slash login, but I will say above it, SFSU register login, because this could be anybody. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, you can you, uh, hover over the logins, because we have like different logins. I know, but ah, ah, drivers, why not? I, I would, okay, my take is if I'm driver, I want to, I click here, it says login, where do I log in? I say, put the driver, login, uh, and then pick up jobs here, restaurant owner, login, register, re, uh, apply for restaurant under these two, and this would be pure SFSU login. Okay. Separate it. You put these as drop downs? Yeah, 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 I would, you know. Mm -hmm. Okay. Also, if you scroll. Good, 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 so you can, ah. Uh, you know, I would, so my, my point is, I would never even see it, so, there's, this is beautiful, but there's no reason for, for it to be so big. Mm -hmm. So one trick people use, you move it and there is an arrow showing there is more down. But I say shrink this and show at least part of it. So people know there is something here, mm -hmm. okay? Or you can actually do them like this, mm -hmm. but avoid scrolling or, or make sure there is indication of, of this. And this, so here is the trick. Make sure if I click here or I click here, it goes to same code. The worst thing is Johnny develops this piece, Mary develops that piece. Two codes, two QAs behave differently. Very confusing. So this has to be exactly input to this mm -hmm. you see what i'm saying it's much simpler okay all right map of S i i would not do a i'm i'm if i'm not a driver i don't need this okay. oh if they ask me where you want it, well i usually know where i want it delivered so no don't do this map only this and shrink it put on one page all right do some uh okay italian where is this menu? How is this menu populated? It's on the back end. It comes from SQL. From the table called categories? Is there a separate table? It's, it's oh, it's, oh, okay, never mind. Then this category. It should be. So category table. We'll come to that later. It's, you should have one table that feeds the search and feeds the uh, restaurant. When I'm in the restaurant and I say which uh, category you are is the same pull down. Mm -hmm. If you, the moment you separate, drama happens. She type American with C, he types with K, and it never finds, and you don't know why it's just one table, but we'll come to that. Okay, so I click, right? I think oh. the Wi-Fi one. Is that the Wi-Fi one? Oh. Yeah, the Wi-Fi one now. It's just the Wi-Fi one now. Oh, yeah, still connected. Because the electricity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we want to switch to electric cars, guys. <laughs> Give me a break. Yeah. yeah. Give me a break. Good map. You do it like Google Map. Oh, ah, one, one results out of one. Or because if I search all, it should tell me, uh, always tell me, what was found out of total. Yeah, mm -hmm. but we're in Italian right now. Yeah, okay, well, one result out of one Italian. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For Oh, I, I tell you why, oh, yeah, 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 come on. If I type something here, I might, might say pasta, you know? Well, they all have pasta, but could be five Italian and only one is serving pasta. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. oh, I see. yeah. yeah. Well, anyway, yeah. so give me some indication, but anyway, um, all right, and you have a map, 
Okay, your text search works, I mm -hmm. presume, right? If you type like pizza. Pizza. Oh, I should. Yeah, you are doing the demo. When you do the demo, you you know what to type, right? Mm -hmm. So have uh, maybe uh, three categories with two, three restaurants each, so you can show some variety. All right. <clears throat> if I do all, yeah, I should get pizza, yeah. Okay. Now um, I click here, right? This should go to a new page. Why is that? Because it's like when you have results and I, a result one, two, three, four, five, I click, I look at it, I don't like it. The first thing people do, they exit. If, if it's not a new tab, they would log out and leave your store and never come back. So you want to put this as a new page, mm -hmm. but with the same, uh, you know, same CSS and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. This looks good. Cart, excellent. Total 50. Check out. And that's it. If I'm not logged in, you then ask me to log in. Fine. Show me uh, uh, now the restaurant, uh, up, uh, the page for restaurant people. This is registration. Good. Restaurant owner registration. Driver registration. Very good. Uh, red star mandatory field always say. Password. Okay. After I submit, where do I go as a restaurant owner? This is the login page. Okay. Pretty simple. And then here you have like a restaurant application. No, but after I log in, mm -hmm. do you then put me into this page? Um, I think it would take you back to the no, home. It would take you back to the, the last one there, my restaurants. This one? Which is automatic, no, the... This one? Yeah, my it shows you... Um, yes, to my dashboard. That's the, excellent. Because if you put me here, I, you know, where do I go? My restaurants and then should be... <clears throat> register another restaurant, very good. Should be a, a enter menu or update menu. Mm -hmm. Here, to right? edit it. Okay. Makes sense. <laughs> oh, it's a, this is a motion. A movie, yeah, yeah. All right. So enter menu. Menu without, I, I'm saying if you want no pictures for menu, I'm okay with it. Just make it simple. Restaurant, one picture, menu, uh, list, a price, and that's it. So in the restaurant application, it kind of like shows you. Uh, yeah. You Add restaurant. Image. Uh, usually images yeah, usually add the okay I see add image too many images just one image well it's like um, per each one per each menu item you can add an image or you don't have to, it's like kind of up to you. yeah it's up to you guys if you want to uh, uh, add restaurant image restaurant name food category that goes to the same category table delivery time very good description uh, I would, uh, aha, okay, uh, this, restaurant application, uh, general, general restaurant information title, and then add restaurant image, blah, 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 and then enter individual menu items, make a nice title, one column you did very well, align on the left, this is very good. I allow you, if you, if you don't want to have image, it's fine, okay? And, but have a food name, price, description. Very good. Okay. Driver. Driver. Let me show you. So it goes to right here. Driver registration. Driver. Title. Yes. Thank you. Star mandatory items. Get paid with I believe if that. you hover, hover over them, the star will show you that it's required. Yeah, but if, if you want us to write mandatory yeah, items. Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, a lot of people do it. Confirm password, yeah, maybe confirm you have valid driver license. And, mm -hmm. You know, what? and this is dummy link, but you have to, if I don't check this, this doesn't work. Mm -hmm. So you have to code it, but you don't need page for this. Okay, good. And then driver register. So give me the use case for driver. Um, so you're, you're a driver, you would register for through the registration. And then it, if you need to, it would log you in, but then okay. it would take you to orders. So here Very you have your good. orders. And then? You can choose to pick one of the orders. Take, good. Right, and then it takes you to the order details. 
So then this is where the driver would then pick up the the order. You have a restaurant location, the restaurant. Good. Um, and so yeah. there is like my task, my order details. Ah, not order. Uh, order delivery details this is not order for me to eat it's order to deliver <laughs> Just driver yeah. welcome uh, 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 driver welcome name mm -hmm. just so it's clear where you are it's not the order of food it's driver thing mm -hmm. and that's good and that's it yeah don't and don't the yeah and then uh, take yes. order okay. and then then it would take you to this page where it would Theoretically, take you. To uh, give me a list. Okay. When I say take order, I say exactly what you did, mm -hmm. but have a list of orders because I can show it on, on this and then a little link uh, campus, SFSU campus map, and that's it. Mm -hmm. Very simple. Because, you know, I picked up two out of five orders, show me, you know whatever my orders and show me the list and that's it make it very simple okay and then i'd say for orders actually show here show a list of orders and show the map of campus static mm -hmm. because you cannot put a point in the office but just have a map okay and then make it all responsive design so when i'm driving that's where responsive most of the stuff i'll do Probably, well, ordering food also. Restaurant registration probably from the laptop, but driving order will probably be, you know, I want to see it on my mobile. So just make it responsive. Okay. All right, so UI is, is pretty good. Show me GitHub. All right, here you go. GitHub, nice. Um, the main. Oh. Nice okay. okay. Uh, show me application and show me history. Just click on history. I want to see commit comments. That's my favorite stuff. Update restaurant menu card. With what? So, fixed menu. Mm -hmm. no. For what? Why? You have one hour to find the bug. It was somewhere in whatever... Um, CSS and it just says fixed menu uh, fix the bug I update the, the page for what you know so in architecture slides I gave you a link for github one line comments that will serve you well when you interview how to write one line comment in github commit actually industry characters look it's part of code review it should be self explanatory up to one line so, where is the good one? Connects, added, still. Comments and authors added, rename, order items to tickets. Boo. I'm not sure I get it. Merge branch, CSS for check or fixed. CSS for checked, fixed, and the fix didn't work. There were three fix done. Something was messed. So I have to check three versus C, uh, the fix for search didn't work. So CSS for search fixed. And if I need to fix the fix for search, I know where to go. So you have to be specific, a bit more specific, okay? Okay. Commit, show me some search code. You guys know exactly where it is? Any, any kind of reasonable code. Okay. Oh, your font. What is the purpose of this code? Nice. Andy, you have one second. One second. Adding more information to the user and do query. Should so be a header comment. Who developed? Who do you call if you're lost in this code? Uh, Emily and Eunice. Aha, you have some. So, just a nice a header with basically the purpose just state don't assume people know purpose of this code is to do this basic input basic output uh, 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 owner and then fixed just some names and stuff 
-hmm. And then uh, uh, line comments here and there. Then I look at text. Can I read the code like English? Select from team seven restaurant, where restaurant name, okay, logical. Remember the APIs for Google Maps? You read the code, it's all clear. You don't even need to comment. So, uh, uh, and these names have to correspond to your data dictionary. So, if you call it establishment, then it's establishment. If you call it restaurant, it's restaurant. It has to be, the namespace has to be consistent. So, this is not that bad. Just add the header comments, okay? And that's also people watch it. It's part of code review. In real code review, no header comments, you return it. So there could be five lines, 10 lines. That's okay. Show me, so who is going to run the uh, workbench? Yes. You can do it from your laptop. Okay. I can move. Yeah. Show me, uh, very good. So, there will be, show me the restaurant. Okay, passwords are encrypted, users, okay. Are you going to have different user tables for drivers yes. and restaurant? Good. No, we have them right here. The okay. We haven't made any drivers. Okay, fine. Show me the restaurant thing. How can you click it so well? <laughs> I ate at <laughs> 11. Huh? Oh my God. Almost eight hours since my last meal. Why? <laughs> no, you should not do that to you. It's not good for your brain. Just And then you throw sugar. Protein, is, you know, protein, health is, now you, sugar is okay a little bit, but okay. Don't live off of chocolate and Coke. There was a kid who left home and never cooked her stuff and was, ended up in emergency. They found out for a month First month in school, drank Coke and ate chocolate only. So, careful, not good for you. All right, description, seriously. So, this should be, so one of your tasks is category, foreign key to category table, and, and that feeds the menu and stuff. Then you maintain one thing, image, uh, 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 path names, this is relative, right? I believe that when you do slash like this, it should be relative to application directory. I think it should be some dot dot or something. Mm -hmm. Check the class slides. There is like how to manage path names. The reason is you, you move it to server, you move it to another server, everything collapses. Mm -hmm. So everything relative to application directory. Other, other, and, then, and then here should be a column called live which is default false. When you inspect, you, you flip it to, to true. So um, maybe Andy does the demo, and then Andy enters the restaurant, then they say, Andy, try to search for that restaurant. It's not there. The admin approves it, you flip the bit, you search again, and the restaurant shows up. That's kind of the demo in the class. All right, so finally, uh, so you guys are in good shape. So category table, I trust you'll do it, but do it now. It, it makes life much easier. Okay. Um, teamwork, how is teamwork? They're doing really well, honestly. Okay. Team's killing it. Um, um, team project, tasks, name, task, deadline, and then checkpoints. Stand, very simple, it's actually very simple. Yeah, I could do a better job at doing that. Honestly. I know, I but know. just make it tight. Uh, in VMware, I was doing it without any tool. I, I had a piece of paper that I updated a, a doc, doc file on some server. There was no, no Google Docs. Basically, task, description, who is involved, deadline. And every morning I check it, and that's it. And then you step back and make sure are all tasks covered. All the pages have owners. So assign somebody to continue work on this, assign somebody to add the category table and stuff. <clears throat> How many restaurants for demo? Three, four categories, three, four in each category. That's about 15, good enough. You don't need to have images for every menu item, as far as I'm concerned. But make the restaurant 
kind of title general information then menu information so it's nice and clean one column scrollable so you can go back and forth every every time you do a new page it's a separate page you might lose the context and it's easier for me to go back and forth by scrolling okay visual contact any risks that you see no i feel like we're doing pretty good but don't let the guard down okay you're doing pretty good and the simulator in my office i have another project for you to do because he's doing pretty good he has plenty of time you're talking to me yes i'm saying don't be too positive to your boss okay don't be too negative either no risk we are very busy but we can do it we are doing great we are having great fun it's easy project bingo they give you extra work but yes but if you say it's disaster then they fire you find somebody yeah. else it's, we're doing great but it's very busy it's very difficult uh, and and you will it has to work on on two browsers it has to be no bugs there will be work okay Understood. all right so you guys are came up a long way after the disastrous requirement <laughs> stuff, okay? <laughs> so, all right, good. No checkpoints, but you have your own checkpoints, okay? okay. Come, team.